At this point, he's lining up the um, the little screws so they're, they're offset. Good marriage. never know. So if you make it in English, you know what you'll be able to run off. It's the only thing I've already learned that English, all you have to do is make it a fucking As long as it sounds good. I think it's the second screw down on the top. First will be in the backside and then come forward. Uh, what's wrong with oh, so you just put this and let it roll, and the light spot will come to the top. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh my goodness! It's really We're pretty cool. We're supposed to be videoing this, aren't we, Doug? I am. Oh, I'm videoing it right now. What if you get some friction out of the concrete block? Mama said so. Well, concrete blocks is just oh, it doesn't have to sit still, so it's got bearings inside here. Yeah. Yeah. So now, now what's happening is we're finding the light spot in the tire. Yeah. Just by letting it naturally do its thing. Next thing is, how do you know how much weight to add? Do you just keep adding. Oh, there's, there's there's weights on there. There's weight. There's currently weights on here. Right. And you can see by where the these weight placements are, and you can see where, how the tires ro rotating back and forth. It's saying this is the lightest point in the tire right now. Yeah. So when I remove this weight, that point is actually going to move. It's how do you know how many weights to add to it? We don't. You just add till it stops we, doing we this? Phil, so if I, if I move that tire like that, yeah. where the weights are down here, now it's rolling back up. Yeah. If I if I roll them weights over here, it's rolling back this way. So yeah. I know those weights are wrong in that okay. wrong spot, wrong amount. So the best thing to do is just to remove the weights. Hi, Georgia girl. Yeah, like, the tire store probably charged me about eight bucks for those little lead pieces, right? Or more. So now, so now that we remove the weights, we let the tire bounce back out to 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 its light spot again. I'll be I won't be quite that much on this Yeah, Peter, I was supposed to put my pictures on a jump drive. Here. Oh, okay. Yeah, I got computer right over here. So now we know our light spot is at 12 o'clock. Okay. Okay. How'd you get back? Did you ride back or fly back? My dad brought my scooter back because I had to be. Now I got to mark the tire. Normally I mark the tire with a paint stick or something like that. I don't have a paint stick. So I'm going to clean. Uh, no, he graduated from Chattanooga. Right there. So he had to, my sister had to be back. Yeah, I read my dad following me. I know where that, that light spot is. Now i got to figure out how much weight that we need. So I'm just going to take some random weights that I have laying around and place them on there. And we'll, and we'll just... I'm going to just keep testing until we find out the amount of weight. We took off one, two, three, four, what are those? Quarter ounce or seven grams. You, we took off 21 grams of weight. Okay. There's seven grams a piece? Yes. Take off quarter, four? Quarter, three. Three. Yeah. Quarter ounce is seven grams. Okay. And that's still not enough weight. Wow. Those are the ones that came off mine. The weights? Yeah, those weights came off my left tire. 
That's still not enough. Water. I actually put, but you have it in a slightly different spot. Don't you? Yes, a slightly different spot because that's that that is the true light spot. They're all smart. It was actually shinier before I was Yeah, but it was satin and it was so watered down. I wish I had some duct tape. What? Now, my, the amount of weight I placed on there, you can see it's heavy. Right. Somewhere else. No. The, the spot, though, the spot hasn't changed. I put too much weight on it. So now I gotta, now I gotta take more weight off. Eliminate something. All I'm doing is process elimination, trying to find. You had five weights right there to start with. Oh, I'll figure it out. After it looks like you have four left on there. And he took one off. Well, that's pretty close right there. Oh, that is really close. See how the tire is barely moving? The weights are staying right here, about the 9 o'clock position. That's There's no good. light spot anywhere. That, that means now I should be able to take it and put it over here. Stay. And it's staying. Yeah, so that's really good. There's no longer a light spot. There's no longer a light spot. It's not rotating. With that knowledge, now I do the math. Are you done over here? One, two, three, four. I need four. I think he knows you already. Still seven grams. Are they? Still quarter out of seven grams. Yeah. I need my reading glasses to see that. Just more Still seven grams. Seven grams is seven grams. Hot huh? brats over here again so I can put some more out. I'll get you some brats. Hooray for brats. Oh, okay. Seven. Quarter ounce of seven grams. Those are quarter ounce weights. Huh. Thicker. It doesn't matter. Those are right. aluminum. No, I know they're marked. These are aluminum. These are uh, these are lead. Oh, okay. So now, before I stick them on there, I'm, I'm gonna I'm, I cut my 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 weights. I'm gonna actually stick on there. I'm gonna leave the uh, sticky back the sticky back on them. I'm gonna place it in position. Tape it on there. Just double check. Exactly. Yeah, because once you stick that sticky on, they're wasted. Look at that. It stays right at 10 o'clock position. Yeah. Golden. So I should be able to move it at 3 o'clock. Golden. Look at that. I got a slight, slight, slight movement. Yeah. But it's going to worry about though. See, see how it actually stopped? Yeah. That's a goal. Yeah. I mean, that, I mean, we're we're at the exact right spot we need to take that. Well, I'll know tomorrow if it gets rid of the wobble, but my gut level is probably not. So now I want to clean that, clean that area. Talking, you're talking uh, one ounce of weight and you peeled off. No, I peeled off. I peeled off 21 grams, not more than 28 grams. Right. So you're adding a quarter ounce and you're shifting it about an inch. Yeah. yeah. So this part, he's just lightly touching it on there in case he has to move it. Now, the other thing is you have it on the outside of the rim. They had it towards the center of the rim. If you look at your mass of your rim, you, you, got, you, got, a, you got a mass offset already. So I'm, I'm, I'm trying to keep the mass offset as well. I'm trying to balance the mass. There's no reason to have it there. I mean, as long as it's on there, it's really good. It works, it works really well. Um, I had some tires once I got it on the car that uh, the guy stuck all the weights on the inside of the wheel. 
and it would just feel just right, and then all of a sudden it would shake like crazy. On a car, on a car, a car tire is totally different. Yeah. you got to balance the inside and the outside of the room. That's what I was wondering is if you have to do that with ease. No. No? It was just the side with All right. That's the end of the video. He's pressing on, it's done.